The state says Troy University will have to continue waiting before it receives a COVID-19 vaccine. Despite Alabama's SEC schools, Auburn University and the University of Alabama receiving doses in the first week of January. Although the Alabama Department of Public Health says it's limiting the shots to health care providers, nursing home residents, emergency personnel, and those older than 75, Auburn University has confirmed with us it's vaccinating its campus community first, appearing to go against the state's guidelines. Auburn University is vaccinating its students and staff, yet no word here in Montgomery from Governor Ivey or the Alabama Department of Public Health on why the university was prioritized above others and more notably senior citizens, those 74 and younger in the state who can't get their hands on the potentially life saving vaccine. I'm 73 years old and I cannot get to shop because I'm not 75. I take diabetes medicine. I take five shots a day for di I'm a di diabetic. I uh, take blood pressure medicine and uh, I have high cholesterol I'll take medicine for. Yet I hear students at Auburn are getting shots, but I can't get them because I'm not 75 years old. That's what some seniors across the state are feeling right now as vaccines are limited. State Health Officer Dr. Scott Harris recently said the state could not begin vaccinating those under 75, saying we don't have any more vaccine to AL.com. Meanwhile, Auburn said some of its students are getting the vaccine. As for Troy University, it will have to continue waiting. Auburn is a separate university from Troy. They can certainly do what they feel is necessary to uh, to meet their current needs. I think Troy's position is, is that uh, we're working very closely with ADPH to follow what they've asked us to follow in terms of uh, when we would get the vaccine, how it would be stored and, and distributed. And so, you know, I, I think that we're really focusing on what we need to do for our community and to service our, our university community.